Mikey Pipes with Peter Pan. Peter Piper, or we just call him Peter. Thank you so much for tuning in. Today is Wednesday, May 24th, 2023. Uh, we're heading to a Mikey Pipes philanthropy service call. In case you don't know what that is, uh, Mikey Pipes Philanthropy Charitable Organization is a recognized IRS 501c3 charity, public charity, where we provide urgent essential home repairs, plumbing, heating, and cooling uh, to those in the community who can't afford to hire a professional. I try to you know, promote the fact that everyone, regardless of color, skin, religion, nationality, regardless of anything, right? The basic human right is shelter, sanitary conditions in your living space, right? That means you need to have a, a sink that you can wash your dishes in, a toilet that works, heat. If, you know, if you live in a climate where air conditioning is, you know, if you had air conditioning in the home, listen, yeah, let's fix your air conditioning too. So the purpose of the Mikey Pipes Philanthropy Charitable Organization is to promote awareness and to perform urgent essential home repairs for free or low cost to those in the community who can't afford it. Today, we're heading over to Ozone Park in the borough of Queens, in the city of New York, in the great state of New York. Uh, this is a second time recipient, by the way. Uh, we're going to Robert. Uh, he's, he's going through a lot of medical problems and uh, unfortunately the prognosis is not good for him. It's not. And um, every time we schedule something, it gets canceled because he has he's rushed to the emergency room. Um, he's not that old either, you know, but he's, his time, unfortunately, on this earth, and I hate to say it, you know, is limited. But, you know, God works in mysterious ways. You know what? And maybe if we just say, get together and do a few prayers, maybe we can save, save his life. But until then, uh, we're going over to his house. He has a, uh, a broken hose faucet. The toilet's all messed up. And uh, we got to do something with the steam radar because he turned it off uh, at the end of the heating season. So let's go over there and see what's going on. Please smash that thumbs up button. If you're interested in donating to the Mikey Pies Philanthropy Charitable Organization, you can donate uh, through PayPal, uh, Venmo, or Zelle. Your donation is a tax deduction. All right. Uh, we're a recognized 501c3 charity uh, based in New York and we already did uh, several jobs including a brand new Bosch dual fuel heat pump system donated by Bosch uh, Thermal Technology for a, uh, a family in Vander Grift, Pennsylvania. Let's go say hi and let's give this guy some uh, you know some some peace of mind and uh, just re restore some normalcy into his life. You ready for us Robert? I'm doing well. How you been? You hanging in there? Hanging in there. All right, Peter. I know you're not used to plumbing repairs, but you gotta get your hands dirty sometime. Oh, I did What's that. up with the flex seal on the on the on the ball cock? I did that by mistake. Flex seal by mistake. How do you do flex seal by mistake? Can, Tell me. Can, How do you do it by mistake? I opened the can. Yeah. I was doing something a little project on the side, and it just sprayed all over the place. Well, I let's see no, what happens when you flush I got the no toilet. <laughs> It's 2022. True. I just died in the hospital. All right. So what happens? The chain gets stuck up on this it thing? Gets, it gets stuck all the time. It gets stuck. I put, they put a new chain on there. All right. We're going to get you a new flapper. You know what? We're gonna also going to change the fill valve. I'm holding down. I have the, the valve off right there. Holding that down. Get, try to get all the water out of the out of the tank. All right. I'm going to change the uh, the flapper. The flapper. I love this. Uh, this is really a, a home, that's a Home Depot universal uh, tank lever, I tell you that. Uh, we're here back again. Uh, we were here over the winter. We worked on this radiant over here. It kind of worked, kind of not, but we got some other problems here. And we're here to do a free service call. The purpose of the Mikey Pipes Philanthropy Charitable YouTube uh, channel and the Mikey Pipes Philanthropy uh, Charitable Organization is to provide urgent and necessary Plumbing, heating, cooling services uh, to those who can't afford to hire professionals. So here we are. We're giving Robert second time beneficiary of, of the uh, of the organization. We're going to fix the toilet. We're going to probably fix the steam radiator again. We'll get it done right this time. <laughs> Oops. Uh, we also got a hose faucet. So smash that thumbs up button and please consider subscribing. There's a link down in the description box down below. Or maybe you could 
Scan this QR code that's on the screen right now with your smartphone. You can donate to the to the organization where recognized IRS 501c3 charity and um, your donation is tax deductible. What the hell is going on here? That came with the house. This came with the house? Yeah. So did you try to tighten the packing nut? Yeah, I tried. You did? Yeah. Oh, man. Now it's spewing on me. All right, so we have the water shut off. We're going to use the Wolverine Brass, the ultimate... The Finale Ultimate Toilet Fill Valve. All right, so we have the new fill valve going in as we speak. So now we're going to adjust the chain. And what the fuck is this? What is this? What is that? Huh? Why that was on there? I don't know. So the chain has a little bit of slack on it, right? You don't want no slack on it because if it gets held up on anything, it's gonna, it's gonna continuously, it's not gonna sit down properly and it's continuously run. So there is the Wolverine Finale Ultimate fill valve with the brass shank. We're gonna refill the, uh, the tank in the bowl and then we'll give it a few trial flushes. We're gonna make sure we have no leaks going on underneath here. That looks nice and dry. Okay. And it stopped again perfectly where it needs to stop. I like to go to the top because the more water you have per flush, the more the more your solids get flushed down. All right, Peter. Mm -hmm. We removed this <laughs> improperly placed uh, a ground clamp to... We have a half inch brass coupling right there hooked up to this... Silcock, hose, hose faucet. We're gonna turn off the water to the house and then we're gonna take out this hose faucet. Valve, water shut off. <laughs> All right, I have the kitchen sink open. I have now this open now. I'm gonna drain out whatever's left in there. Look at that. You didn't even lick it first and it came right out. Okay, they should be able to do it by hand now. Easy peasy. Look at all that cocky inside there, by the way. It's gross. That's uh, a galvanized pipe uh, juice. Ooh, wow. Oh my. On the fly. Look at that. <laughs> all right. New host faucet is in. The grounding clamp is back on. We put some silicone in there. I did my best to clean up the side of the, the house, but all things considered, good enough for this neighborhood. Okay, you see that bushing? It's gotta come out. That one's gotta go in its place. Compliments of Jasco Plumbing and Heating Cooling Supplies. They're in Yonkers, uh, New York. They compliments of them. They sent us those fittings so we can complete this job. Yeah. Uh, oh well threads have got a lot of cocky on them and i want to have a nice clean surface for this new two by inch and a quarter black reducing uh bushing so peter's got the brush all right peter got all that clean now use the uh, 24 inch wrench let's tighten up that bush Money. Yeah. Once it gets hot, that the, the pipe top gets harder, right? It's not uh, very Yeah. Go ahead, try touching it. I don't want to touch it. <laughs> All right, you good? You always do a good job. All right. We did a good deed. We did. You know, we and, and, and Judy is they call it a mitzvah. Also, chesed, where you're actually doing good for another person directly. I don't think there's a there he is. Hold on, he's, he's, he wants more. He's he's ready to talk more. Oh, the radiator cover. Ready to cover? <laughs> oh, just when we thought we we're out of here. <laughs> no!